highs of 10 to 14 Celsius. Hello, good afternoon. This is BBC News with me, Ben Brown. Our headlines at five. A report into the Manchester Arena bombing in 2017 says the performance of the emergency services fell far below the standard it should have been and that at least one of the 22 people who was killed would probably have survived if help had arrived earlier. Many things did go badly wrong and it has been the job of this inquiry to identify them work out if possible why they went wrong and make recommendations to ensure if possible that they don't happen again. She would have survived had she been given the correct medical attention she needed. I do believe that. We let the families and the public down in their time of need and for that I am truly sorry. And we are expecting in the next few minutes a uh, reaction from the Mayor of Greater Manchester, Andy Burnham. Uh, we'll bring that to you live from Manchester. The other headlines this hour. The Bank of England has raised its base rate to 3%, an increase of three quarters of a percentage point as it tries to contain inflation. If we do not act forcefully now, it will be worse later on. And as the forecast we are publishing today shows, it is a tough road ahead. The former Pakistani Prime Minister Imran Khan was shot as part of an assassination attempt while campaigning in the east of the country. It's been reported he was hit in the foot and injured, but his life is not in danger. We're going to take you straight to Manchester now, where we're going to hear from Andy Burnham, the Mayor of Greater Manchester, with his reaction to that report into the Manchester 